The first plant I want to talk about is Erisimum bolsmov, or the Serbian wallflower. It's a perennial plant, will flower for nine months of the year, so an excellent plant for a garden like this. A magnificent colour, you can see the purple flowers, colourful for such a long, long period of time. It needs a sunny location, very, very important to provide a sunny environment for it. If you don't do that, its longevity will be much shorter and its flowering time will also be much shorter. The only negative, I suppose, that's associated with this plant is that its longevity is about five years or so. But when you get magnificent flowering for nine months of the year, you certainly can sacrifice longevity. A wonderful garden plant. Don't plant it in a wet situation. It needs a dry situation and it needs sun. My second plant is Helleborus orientalis, the winter hellebores. The winter hellebores are fabulous plants, fabulous colouring plants. They flower also for a considerable period of time. You can see by the beautiful purple flowers on this plant, which have been there since early in the year, and now we're coming into May and they're still flowering. The variety here is Tricastin hybrids, uh, compared to the ordinary winter hellebore, which is white flowered. But these are beautiful colours, excellent for a perennial border, excellent for a location like here. And also, they're a plant that grows very well in shade. So you can see in this garden here, most of the hellebores are in the shaded environment. So ideal plants in an ideal location in this garden. My third choice is a small tree known as Amelanchier canadensis, or snowy mesable. Amelanchia is an excellent tree. In fact, it's an excellent tree for, for all suburban gardens. It doesn't get too big, not over vigorous, so it's ideal in all kind of suburban locations, particularly in small gardens. This tree, over the next number of years, as the tree gets bigger, it will have a profusion of flowers in the month of April as we go into May. It also will have bronze foliage right through the summer months, obviously becoming green as the season progresses. Its maximum height is about two and a half metres. It will have multi-stems coming up from the ground. A standout tree in any garden.